Hi guys, welcome to this video. In this video I'm going to be showing you a free piece of software called Slim Computer. You can get it from this website here, slimcomputer.com. works with Windows 7, Vista and XP. Um, mostly new computers nowadays come full of trialware pre-installed on a computer. So if you've bought a brand new computer, it will always come with uh, Norton or McAfee, AOL, loads of different types of um, software that you don't really want on your system and they normally give you a short period of time like uh, 15 days and so, and so you know you say you want to uninstall those but that can be a bit of a bind you know normally it comes with a load of toolbars as well and stuff like that but this piece of software you download it and it will actually highlight all these and just un uninstall them all in one foul swoop uh, it's also got an optimization tool on here an uninstaller and also uh, shortcuts for the windows tools as well so let's uh, fire the actual program up so I'm just going to quickly install this here this will quickly install. It's pretty painless, really. You just need to go through the motions. Once this is installed, we can then do a scan now. This is not a brand new mach machine, so there won't be much trial wear on here, so it may not come up with much in the scan, but I can uh, show you what the program looks like. It's got quite a nice little uh, user interface to it. For a free program. Okay, so this is the front of the actual computer. As you can see, uh, the program you can see here: login, settings, updates, and help. So we can have a look at the settings tab. There's a couple of little options here: really general, run at startup, uh, install the portable version, and also you've got a schedule, which is um, basically you can schedule your scans if you want to scan at a certain time or day. Okay so this is the actual main screen as I said so what we're going to do is do a quick scan here click on run scan run, it will scan the actual system Now, normally there will be loads and loads of different types of applications and toolbars that come pre-installed Google, Yahoo, they normally all come pre-installed on brand new machines and you don't really want them on there it just slows the system up okay so as you can see we've got the um, options here so these are the options here that we've got for the applications uh, as you can see there's not many here but uh, if you look at the actual screenshot that I've got here you'll see basically uh, this is a screenshot and this is what it will do is it will find uh, all the different parts that you want to get rid of okay this is obviously for an Acer machine and I've got one more screenshot here for you because I haven't got many on there, let me just uh, blow that up a bit. As you can see, for HP as well, it finds a load of stuff that you can get rid of. Okay, now these are obviously yellow or optional, but it's entirely up to you. Okay, so as I said, there's the options here you got this red is unwanted, and so on. You can change it and save it, and it'll upload to their database as well. Have a look at the toolbars here. Now, obviously, if it was a brand new machine, you'd have like Ask.com, uh, Yahoo, Google, loads of toolbars they add in there for some reason, sometimes uh, overdoing it. But you can undo those and get rid of them if you want, okay? Uh, let's have a little look at the startup. Again, you can do whatever you like here. Take these out. You might probably have a big list of stuff here if it's a brand new machine, so they always seem to load it up with loads of stuff. Okay, so if you want to leave them in there the ticks and just push remove it will remove those I'm not going to remove anything in this video so we've got a restore button here as well there's an optimi optimization or optimizer that you can use and uh, as you can see start up it will optimize the uh, start up and also services so you can remove uh, remove which is selected so if you want to remove something you put the tick in and it will actually remove that uh, item okay also um, like so and then you just put the ticks in on the stuff that you want to remove and ticks that you uh, like that we've got services and this will remove services as well to speed up performance which is quite useful and also you got a restore list here okay 
uninstaller as well you've got the uninstaller if you wanted to uh, use the uninstaller to uninstall a program it allows you to uninstall this is the like the uh, traffic like sort of look green amber and red red is bad so if any of these are red you can get rid of them got an optional one here again same thing and the helpful part okay so you can click on this and it will take you to that site and tell you what that is okay if you don't know as you can see read the description okay and there's some comments down here so you can add a comment if you want quite a useful program um, let's have a little look Windows tools again Windows tools very useful little uh, shortcuts to areas on your computer so for instance system information disk management and so on you click on these and it will open up uh, the links to them okay so I hope you enjoyed this video my name is Brian from brightech.co.uk if you enjoy my videos please remember hit the subscribe button show your support and uh, if you want to join the forums by all means head over to the forums there's the actual forums here you can get over there by going to this web address become part of the community and uh, got any problems with your PCs then post them on the forum we'll do our best to help you there's loads of tutorials on here as well uh, that help you uh, fix problems and stuff like that okay so uh, thanks again for watching guys bye for now